That's what Mike McCarthy is. Mr. Analytics now. Mr. Uh, fake punt on 4th and 11 on your own 24-yard line. What up, it's your boy Tony Murrow coming to you live from Go Talk 419. Just a little vlog uh, over the upcoming NFC Championship game. Uh, please be on the lookout for the Go Talk podcast with my partner, with Dale Donaldson. That's going to be coming soon. <clears throat> Excuse me. But I could be more happier with this matchup. Like, it's the GOAT versus Tom Brady. You know what I mean? It's the greatest quarterback I ever seen touching football, Aaron Rodgers, versus Tom Brady, hand up in a playoff game with everything. On, like, finally, finally this has happened. I wish it could have been a Super Bowl, Green Bay, New England. But finally, we get to put all the questions to bed, okay? It's all done. This is it. It's all been coming to a head for this. So it was like Aaron Rodgers. Everybody was trying to say he was washed after last year. You know what I mean? All he had was what? 4,000 yards, 26 touchdowns, 4 interceptions. But he's washed. Washed my ass. You think James, Witt, James Winston would have traded that for that 5,030 for 30 ball? I guarantee you he would. But like Aaron said, his down years are other players' career years. Right? Tom. All those top 10 scoring defenses you play with. Aaron Rodgers played with one. The year he won the Super Bowl. Oh, what a coincidence. Makes sense, right? Did everybody thought Mike McCarthy's this great coach, this great offensive mind. You know what I'm saying? He calls his own plays, blah, blah, blah. Fuck out of here, man. Over the years, it's like, well, is it Mike or is it Aaron? Then Mike gets gets took out of the equation, and guess what? We go 13 to 3. What do we do the next year? 13 to 3 at the age of 37. This might be the, my greatest year ever. 48 touchdowns, 5 interceptions. Might be the greatest year of uh, any quarterback. Put it all together like this at the age of 37. What's Mike McCarthy doing? A historically bad shithouse Cowboys defense. A waste of talent. An owner who won't stop meddling in the business. That's what Mike McCarthy is. Mr. Analytics now. Mr. Uh, fake punt on 4th and 11 on your own 24-yard line. Yeah, so we actually see who it is. It's Aaron. And like... That's the thing. And I know you're going to say, oh, but Tony, well, time left. He's doing good. The Patriots did bad. Did you say that that's what would, you said the Patriots would do good at time? Well, listen. Did I know that nine players were going to opt out? No, I did. Did I know that the only semblance of a receiver is Julian Edelman? I think he played two games. I don't know not one tight end. I think they got, like, Nikhil Henry and Jacoby Myers. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Cavs running the ball 30 times a game. He just came off shoulder surgery to begin with. Like, he's catching COVID. Come on, man. What what did you expect to happen? Why do you think Tom wanted out? Why do you think Tom went to Florida? He wanted Mike Gavis, Chris Godwin. Cameron Bray, O.J. Howard. Oh, let's bring in little Frigette. Oh, we got Rojo already back there. Oh, let me call up A.B. Why do you think he dipped? Oh, we had a defense that was uh, number one in the league stopping the rush last year. Oh, guess what? They're number one stopping the league, uh, stopping the rush this year. The front seven. Top saw it. He was smart. I don't knock him. But don't just try to flip it like, oh, he left and that's just, he just ex- succeeding because he's just that much better than, no. He's in a favorable situation and Ill Bill got 
a situation he created. I'm not saying that, but still, you you can't compare that. But yeah, guys, like this is the NFC Championship game we all could have dreamed of, man. 2021 blessed us. 2021 blessed us so far. It blessed us, man. So please comment, like, subscribe. It's your boy. It's gonna be goat versus goat to push that ticket for the Super Bowl. And 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 listen, and, and and before I sign off, let me deliver this to the masses. Let me tell the masses this. America, if Tom, if Tampa Tom delivers a title to the Buccaneers, I'll say he's the GOAT. I'll bow down. I'll say he's the GOAT. I'll say he's the greatest I've ever seen do it. If he can deliver a title to the Bucks in Tampa Bay, Super Bowls in Tampa Bay, I'll say he's the GOAT. But yeah, please comment, like, subscribe. Who y'all think the GOAT is? Let me know. Tell me why. All right, peace.